Hey, what's up everybody? You know who it is, your boy Juju. And today I'd like to talk about something near and dear to my heart. Trophy hunting. Whether they are called trophies or achievements, I like collecting them. I think it's fun to hunt for them in a game I enjoy. I often make the conscious decision to go for all the trophies and earn myself a lovely platinum, based on a few factors like how long is the game? How difficult is the game? How much do I enjoy the game? Will the effort I put in actually be worth it? Is the feeling of accomplishment for having earned a platinum trophy an adequate substitute for my desire to feel any sort of validation for my- Okay, that's enough of that, but no, seriously. I enjoy spending some of my free time pursuing platies, as they are sometimes called, and I'm proud to say that as I'm recording this video, I've got 25 of them, which is neat. And I've been told that's a lot, but I've literally got friends who have like 40 plus of them, and they just keep getting more. I'm sorta jealous, but not when I have to deal with games like this. Rayman Legends. This one. This freaking platinum trophy, I swear. Okay, wait. First, how about some context? Way back when, in 2013, I played and platinumed Rayman Origins on both the PS3 and PS Vita. Yeah, I, I own one of those. I loved Origins. Easily one of my favorite platformers. Not entirely sure why, though. Rayman Legends comes out. I get it on PS Vita play it, try to platy it, and realize that it asks me for so much. One trophy involves me having to earn a diamond cup at the end of an online challenge that is posted both daily and weekly. Sounds easy? Well, you're competing against players all around the world and have to essentially be in the 1% of people who get the best scores on these surprisingly sometimes difficult challenges. Since you're competing with people, anyone who beats your score on time can potentially knock you down a cup. As if being in the 1% to get a diamond cup wasn't difficult enough. Not only that, but one of the trophies is to earn 6,000 points in the game. After 100% completing literally every single level, and doing some challenges on the side while doing that, I ended up with a little over 4,000 points. Which of course left me with nothing to do but challenges. The highest amount of points you can earn from a trophy is the Diamond Cup's 50 points. But I'm not Jesus, so I can't do that well. So I have to essentially earn Gold Cups or higher every day for about a few months to even think about getting enough points. That's an asinine level of grinding. And that's just factoring in someone's ability to actually be good in a challenge and earn at least a gold. Needless to say, it was only after I earned every other trophy that I realized this dilemma. I gave it a shot, but eventually burned out. But hey, at least I actually gave my Vita some love. Flash forward to the present, where Rayman Legends was featured free on PlayStation Plus for PS4 as of today's recording last month. I downloaded it, remembering I enjoyed the game for the most part, not as much as Origins, but I knew I'd play it again. I had forgotten why I had such not-so-fond memories of this title, until recently, when I started trying to get all the trophies for this version. I beat all the levels, and was hit with the realization that I was required, REQUIRED no less, to get good and grind out tedious samey challenges every day for three months straight to get this platinum. Currently, I'm trying it again, because of course I am, and I hate myself, but right now, I'm starting to burn out. But I'm so close to getting it, and it's the last freaking trophy I need. Other than earn a million of the in-game's currency, which I'll probably get just by doing the challenges alone, but that's whatever. Granted, there was no bullshit trophy about getting a diamond cup in a challenge in this version, so I technically have less to do, but I still have to waste time. I could be spending playing other games <laughs> and spending time with loved ones. <laughs> Look, I'm okay with a little bit of tedium. I've spent about 356 hours trying to platinum Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, and I did it. About 82 hours trying to platinum DMC Devil May Cry. Yes, that one. But that's because I legitimately enjoyed both games, fight me, and I'm happy to say that getting both those platinums are probably two of the most proudest things I've ever done as a video game player. So here I am, folks, torn between my almost OCD desire to earn this platy and my desire to move on and continue playing different games. And making more videos on time for once, of course. Or maybe you could go outside and be a socially active person. Maybe get a girlfriend, Juju, you lonely asshole. I don't know. Mmm, delicious.